There we <laughs> go. A complete and flawless transition. Yes, it works a lot better if we switch to something where the audience can actually hear you more. Yeah, yeah. I knew that. I always knew that. <laughs> <laughs> I will... What do we got in chat? We've got a Christopher Everard and a Brian Knight. And a Bleach. Yeah. And a Sooner History as well. Oh shit, there's a lot of people here. Good thing I'm not autistic. My what God, up, just... bitches? What up, bitches? <laughs> well, what's up is Bezik needs money, so Trim needs a million subscribers. Yes. So I can start paying Bezik for his services. Exactly. <laughs> ah. Well, welcome to the fifth uh, Scribble stream. We're now going to do a little bit of coloring and hopefully some shading and stuff, so yeah. Oh yeah, Christopher, we all need money. God, money is yeah. nice. So, yeah, be nice. want to do some shilling for yourself, Bezik? Wow. Plus, Disco and I did another power washing stream the other day which is now up as a VOD on the YouTubes and I strongly recommend checking it out because we spend approximately an hour bagging out Trim and Arden. Of course you do. I mean, we all, nothing we also, new. We, we also provide help and advice on how to do thumbnails directed entirely as a lecture to, and shaming at Arden. <laughs> <laughs> Featuring such lines as, I was going to say that Trim's thumbnails are on point. Then I remembered who makes his thumbnails. Exactly. <laughs> Me, but I give all the honor to Bessie. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Bleach says, This is a stick up. Empty your pockets. <laughs> Here you go. Would you like a moth or some lint? <laughs> Uh, to be honest, I don't quite like. Yeah, maybe that color. Let's see. Dooby doo doo. God damn it. There we go. What do you guys think? Maybe I have to a bit too brown. Try to do it a bit more, you know, palish. Uh, brown looks pretty good, but once you add some. Texture and shading. It yeah. Nice. I'm thinking we're going on this one. Oh, yeah, that, that's even better. Yeah. Let's see. Can't have too much percentage because then it just bleeds through. Like the claw. Don't insult the claw. Yeah. <laughs> Chris has some dust and it's bleaches now. <laughs> Uh, I hear the dust market is pretty heavy in America now that, uh, I mean, bottle, it was first thought to be bottle caps, but they didn't want to be all new Vegas E just yet, so they're going for dust <laughs> for now. <laughs> oh, dear. Prime's been nursing a sprained ankle. He can walk on it. Just hurts when turning the foot. Oh, oh boy. Yeah, I might just stretch my back. That's not a nice feeling. That's why you always lift with your legs, folks. Unless you're trying to be funny, of course. No, I'm... always lift with your legs. You can be funny, like you can. It's easier to be funny when you're not stuck in bed going. Uh, I <laughs> wish it was dead. Oh. <laughs> uh. Well, a achy back isn't a reason to not be taking a walk, so I took a walk today. That was nice. Well, depending on the cause of the achy back, a walk might be good for it. Yeah. Sometimes you just need to get the muscles working. Oh, yeah. Of course, never walk downhill when you have an achy back. Much better to walk uphill, at least in my opinion. Better to walk on the flat, I reckon, just to get the muscles in your ass working. 
Yeah. And actually, probably the reason a lot of us have back problems is because the muscles in our back spend all day doing nothing because we're usually strapped to a computer chair. Weird, huh? <laughs> Oh, well, yesterday I was at a comedy show in uh, Trondheim, and dear God, I I laughed so much that I could taste iron. <laughs> nice. It was such an amazing thing, and it had so many different people. Like, there was a guy who was uh, of immigrant background, and he is like the theme was when I was young. And his, basically sto his basic story was that... Uh, Basic story, uh, His story was how nobody was able to say his name right. <laughs> so, it's like, ah, they all got used to it. Everyone started almost making bets on, so are you going to call her a girl name or what? But uh, not one teacher basically just looked at the name, got it quiet, and was like, and something else. <laughs> uh... Uh. And that, that wasn't even the that wasn't even the funniest person there. There's a, a lot of different people, and all of them were newcomers or people who had been away from the game for a while and was trying to get in. Dear God, I needed yesterday. That was fucking amazing. <laughs> uh, of course. Uh... The good mood uh, was nice and well until I went to the YouTubes and I saw that the newest Star Wars uh, series were just going to be political. And I thought, like, oh, hey, Star Wars politics. Then I forgot, oh, it's Disney. <laughs> oh. Yeah. So it's... Uh, it's not going to be the politics of Star Wars. It's going to be the politics of now set in the yeah. Mary Sue Wars. Can you guess... No, it's actually a prequel to... Uh... Rogue One, the only good Disney Star Wars movie. And <laughs> here's the fun thing. Of course, it's like, it's it's a good representation of the Trump era. It's like, can, can we just go for one fucking show without you mentioning that Cheeto guy? Please. But, no. but they're so obsessed, aren't they? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. It didn't work with Marvel, then. It's not going to work in the Star Wars form. Jesus, fuck. Yep, but they've got to be obsessed. Orange man bad trim. Oh, yes, yes. Beep, beep, boop. Jesus Christ, there's more variety thought in the B1 battle droids. Ah, <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah. Not the size of it. I mean, aren't they... Can't they be technically classified as legally retarded? Uh, I think they should be classified as illegally retarded, and we should take appropriate steps. Yes. Which we can talk more about, not this weekend, but next weekend in Sultans of Shadowlight. <laughs> Bessick has decided that he's gonna take a note from the book of me and Disco and decide to try this thing called Social Light. So tomorrow, yeah, Sultans... I've heard good things, but I don't believe it yet. <laughs> well, it, it was worth it yesterday, and I... I, I guess you can have fun. I'm pretty sure you can have fun. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Bleach says that Star Wars is dead to him. Student History says it's not an introduction to late Roman politics. It's, in rep it's representative of modern shitbox politics. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Yeah. About the size of it, isn't it? There we go. Social life? <laughs> yeah. What is this thing you talk about? <laughs> Let's see. If the music falls out or if the screen starts acting weird, just uh, tell me and I'll get on it. I'll get on that shit. <laughs> he says he'll get on that shit. <laughs> Well, as much as I can with my extensive non-existent knowledge. The music is definitely being weird, Trim. Oh? 
Oh, it, it's probably for Christopher that it's not, you know, metal. No, I mean it's stuttery and weird and gay. At least on my end. God damn it. So, what could be the reason then? Uh, your computer's dog shite? Well, the. is a laptop, Hold on. but it worked well before, didn't it? Let me. Yeah, it's definitely being dodgy. Ah, crud. I don't know what was the thing though. Did it work last time? Yeah, it worked last time. I don't know what it is this time, but something. Saran wrap around. Oh. Oh. Nah, yeah, it's all sorts of shag, man. Is it too bad to listen to, or do I just remove it? It's too bad to listen to. Crud. Alright. And I am a cancering in the uh, music. Is this one? Yeah. There we go. Actually, yeah, there I'll... we go. That's right. Yeah. I, okay, I can try to launch the, uh, you know, the usual theme, the VLC one. Let's see. A uh, student says, in his defense, for like a social interaction, uh, he works 50 hours a week and really doesn't feel like moving on his one and a half to two days off a week. <laughs> Poor. That is not a little bit. <laughs> 50 hour weeks. That's brutal. Painful. Yeah. How's that? Does that sound better? Well, I can't hear it, so I don't know yet. <laughs> Hold on, let me have a listen. Yeah. Well, it's reacting on OBS at least. Oof. If you're in preview mode, it ha probably hasn't updated yet. Uh, I'm just looking and I see the whole movements. Okay, go. Let's see. Okay, yeah, it's there in the background a bit. Lovely. Oh. I was going to screen share this one with you, Basic, just to be certain. Uh, you can see this, right? Say what? In throne room? Nah, it's not. Yeah, but what am I meant to say? <laughs> the, uh, back, okay. the studio stream is like, error. Error thing? Yeah, I can say that. It's fine. Alright. But... You never know. Yeah, there's nothing we can do about it. Alright. Other than get trim and decent internet. Oh, and a decent inter computer. My internet's pretty good. My computer would be too dog shit. Oh, Bleach has had success. He's sucked some poor woman into dating him. Congratulations! Like, are we talking a. No, no, that's a Sultan's question. <laughs> Let him have this. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Congratulations, Bleach. <laughs> May you find something resembling happiness. Yes, but do we need to have a talk about Rohypnol? Mm, hopefully not. I mean, he's an American. They use guns. <laughs> Prime says, Grats now have six kids and send them to Catholic Army Crusade School. Six kids? No, no, no. If he, do if he doesn't, his own fucking baseball team. <laughs> Seven is the minimum. The holy number. No, he needs to make it to double digits. Hmm. Fair. Keep her barefoot and pregnant in the kitchen. Hmm. Do twelve. Yes. Get yourself a dozen. Aim for as many twins as possible. 
<laughs> what do you think? Having the horns be brown as well? It could be, but I don't think that's gen generally that kind of brown. Mm. Well, from those I've seen close hold, they are either like a pale orange, like the fur, or, mm. you know, wool. We can try it out and see how it goes. Either I can just make it a bit darker. Yeah, it's usually a grey brown rather than a brown brown. Yeah, I think we're doing that then. There we go. Well, I'll just keep more layers is all. Grey brown. A layers. I like layers. Make my makes my hobby so much easier to deal with. <laughs> my drawing or my drawings are like onions. They go in layers. <laughs> yeah, Prime says do horn colour follow fur colour ivory is pale white. And do we need to teach Trim what a goat looks like? I know what a goat looks like. But it's like you have those with dark horn, then you have those with pale. It depends completely on the on the goat itself. <laughs> In all actuality, this goat should have had either a much darker color or a much paler one. Hmm. Am I gonna be that spurgy? It yes. should be. Yes, I'm gonna be that spurgy. I mean, that's why I do these things. Oh. I don't know if any of you have heard of it, but Clinton's whore has been whining about Beyonce, apparently. Or some singer. Clinton's whore? Who is that? Uh, the thing that he found under his desk. Oh, I thought he meant Satan. No, Clinton is Satan's whore. Oh, fair enough, fair enough. Hmm. Yeah, Lewinsky, apparently it was whining about... And I'm like, one, I don't care. Two, maybe you should have thought about that before you crawled under his desk. Have a good suck. <laughs> <laughs> Just another hawker with a guilty conscience. Tends to be like those. Yep, she's like, oh, poor me, I was abused by a powerful man. I'm like, bitch, how much money have you made from books? Hmm. But she didn't enjoy it, she promises. <laughs> she was mm -hmm. a victim. <laughs> Student asks, why was the former presidential flashlight whining? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Appa apparently, she was featured in a song, possibly in the past, even. Oh. And now she's decided that she's not relevant enough. Ah. Like so many other creature looking like women from, especially 20, uh, ten, uh, 2013 to 2016 era. <laughs> Whose names shall not be named. Let's see. Nambidon wants to know why Trim streams from a trash can. This is that bad? That's cold Sweden. <laughs> well then I'm then I'm safe. <laughs> ah shit. No seriously. Yeah, stand, so it's just... <sighs> The audio is weird, Trip. Huh. Trim, are you sure you just selected the right microphone in OBS? Give me two seconds. Uh, you can see this.
Well, I mean, uh, wait, wait, wait. I, I got an idea. It might be because I have my other headset on right now. Yes, so you'd want to go to the drawing and make sure you select that mic. Yeah. I'm using the Bluetooth thing now. Yes. Let's see. There we go. This one? Yes. No, in, in the device trim. <laughs> no, select device for fuck's sake. Click on the click on microphone. Yes. Now go to device up top. There we go. And select the one that actually works. Alright. Ah, uh, look, headset. Is that better? That should be infinitely better. I hope so. Need to see, though, if it is sounding better. better. Oh, that's great. Fucking hell. Alright. That was not my intention, but hey, at least it works. <laughs> One of these days. <laughs> one of these days. Well, that's one of these days. <laughs> that ain't now. <laughs> oh, pain. It, it is. It really is. Unmentionable pain and agony. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, where were we? Yeah. Da -da 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 Yeah, Student History said she was featuring a song back in the day. Why should I care? That's what I thought when it came up on TV. Hmm. Like, why should we care? Is there any reason to give a single fuck? Yeah, she wants Beyonce to remove lyric from, about her from her tish, summer song. Huh. And, like, I don't care, bitch. Have you considered not being a whore? Or if you're going to be a whore, get paid for it, better for it. <laughs> or find a better client. Yeah. I mean, I like the... Nah, I can't just go into this one. This is, that is Sultan's territory. <laughs> Good God, it was tempting to just... Mm -mm. Just want to talk, uh, mention how a certain prophet, you know... Answer a question here. Oh dear. Let's see. Yeah, so far so good. I'll fuck around with that later. <laughs> And everyone says, well, the comedians can't remember which one. Made a good comment on that. People hated Monica Lewinsky because she did what all other women did, but she did it with the top man in the country, not a random Joe on the street. So <laughs> all were just jealous. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I mean, sounds accurate. I don't hear any mistakes there. Let's see. Yeah, she did write books and stuff. She could write? No. Someone wrote a book, stuck her name on it, and she made millions. Hmm. Was it after, before or after she blew the guy? <laughs> the writer? Well, of course it was after. <laughs> Let's see. So, sound is better now, right? Yes. Lovely. Oh, give me a call if ever it starts acting up again. That's the problem with changing audio devices. You need to make sure they're updated. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Yeah. So, okay, make sure we go for here then.
<laughs> no broad says, well, now you're in a plastic storage box, not an aluminium trash box. It's an improvement. I mean, it's just me. I am trash. So, you know. <laughs> yeah, it's accurate. <laughs> Some things cannot be improved upon. <laughs> Let's see. Yes, he's a naughty, naughty trim. Yes. But I stay in it because it's my home. <laughs> also, it's cheaper. Good rent. <laughs> ah, dear trim. Mm-hmm. It's such a silly Norwegian. Well, you know, it's a uh, standard, I guess. <laughs> Or something resembling it. Yes, definitely. You're a Norwegian, though? Yes. Not a smeech. <laughs> better, better than being a sneed. Yes. You. The only thing they have for them is that they sell vanilla cola. <laughs> something to which I have a crippling addiction. But we don't need to talk about that. I'm not addicted. I can hey, stop whenever I, I want. Yeah. I like Ryan. Right. Hey, the birdie! He'd like you to know that he just got out of the shower. Oh. I got out of the shower uh, an hour ago. For more, on only cries. <laughs> I thought we were going to shell only boats here, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> But we gotta be careful, you know how crows have a tendency of carrying grudges. <laughs> and lice. Oh yeah. And they also start domesticating wolves. Wait, what? <laughs> yep. They started forming lifelong friendship with wolves. I don't think we can trust the crows. <laughs> well, I like crows. They're like, uh, they're like a seagull. Bet in every single way. So nothing at all like a seagull. Exactly. I just want to point out that I really, really dislike seagulls. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have a yes. Uh, it's too late, Jonathan. Secrets out. You know, likes the stories of people training crows to steal money and exchange it for treats. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Let's see. Do, do. Mm. An army of sentient crows. That's what we need. Mm. That would be fucking awesome. Though, I guess that would be illegal in uh, every single country that is free, supposedly, quote-unquote. Okay, and what's a free country? Uh, it's this mythological thing, I guess. Yeah. Should I go with the cartoony orange under, or should I ta just take a lighter shade of green? Either the orange or a more light, a lighter scaly color. Hmm. Crow hmm. wants to know if he'd be okay to join you once we've dried off. Oh, sure. No, you can only join us if you're wet. Oh, I mean, that's Bethlehem's fetish, not mine. <laughs> we don't talk about that, dream. <laughs> yeah, I've seen what's in your in your cellar. I don't want to talk about it anymore. <laughs> yeah, but I've seen what's in your browser tabs. Well, that is no secret. <laughs> ah, good times. Let's see. Hmm. No, <laughs> uh, oh dear. Uh, 
Let's see. What do you guys think? This, uh, let's see. There we go. That looks like, that looks like the right color. The green one? No, the uh, one before. I like the one? one before. Alrighty. Yeah. Cool. No. I love how the guy looks so fucking high. <laughs> <laughs> it is. It's the tallest thing on the creature. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, is that that's what you think I meant, huh? <laughs> yeah, totally. I mean, he can light his own joints. <laughs> oh, once he's died off. Well, we know necromancy. You can't escape us. <laughs> I took this uh, online course through this uh, shared space. Or whatever the hell that website is called. <laughs> Skillshare. Skillshare, there we go. Share space, though. Sponsor us, you bastards. <laughs> Sponsor us, and we shall fill you. If not, they'll bug you. Well, that, that's kind of how sponsoring works, Trim. Yes. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Oh, come on. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Hmm? Fun and games. Ooh, fun and games are always nice. I might play some Elden Ring after today's stream. Ooh. I have violence to commit. Me too, but what's that got to do with video games? <laughs> uh... You know, I would disavow it, but unfortunately, I know what you live with, so... <laughs> yeah. But for the sake of snoozins, snow uh... Yes, I do <clears throat> disavow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Are you a link that required to disavow that? <laughs> yes, I am. Unfortunately. I mean, yes, of course I am. Because I am a good member of the party, I promise. <laughs> now it on loves how non slavs try to read out Susan's last name. Yeah, that's Susan Wojacki, right? <laughs> <laughs> I just call her Woke Jeeky. Woke Jackie. Oh, Woke Jackie Alfie. I never promised I would be adult about it. <laughs> no one's, I don't think anyone's ever accused you of being an adult, Trim. Uh, exactly. Did I? Yes, we have a crow. Hey! Hello. 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 There you are. Yes, there we go. How's it going, Cry? I'm not too bad yourself. Lovely. <laughs> you know, the usual contemplating murder. Basic being basic. <laughs> like I said, the usual. Yes. Uh, I mean, I just came back from a walk before doing this stream, or rather, walk then shower, blah 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 blah, so on. Yeah, I just, I got to get ready for going out tonight. So. Ooh. Mm -hmm. You're having a social life, are you? Apparently, yeah. I meant to be going out and um, having a double date kind of thing going on. Oh. Mm -hmm. You gonna score something? Ha ha ha. 
What? Sounds more like one of one of those social events where it's, the woman's like, "Right, Cro Jonathan, you're coming out on this day," and Crow's like, "What?" Says who? <laughs> Ironically, I'm the one who arranged it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Um. The oh, fuck. I've just mm -hmm. been messing around with my mic. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, right. Uh, <laughs> uh dear, so the lighting's slowly coming along, is it, Crow? Yeah, I think you can probably tell. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> well, the fact that I can see nothing behind you and it's perfectly pitch black <laughs> makes me think that there might be some kind of key back there. <laughs> no, no, this is all the lights on, and I haven't oh, turned really? the lights the green screen. If I turn them on. Damn. Uh, yeah. You could just leave them turned off and just go, hey, if it's black, stick something there. <laughs> uh, eventually, obviously, I plan to light the green screen with a solid green, and then it'll be easy to keep. Yeah. Uh, I apologize if I'm quiet primed. I have a tendency not to stay too close to the mic. He's going for that ASMR. Oh, for that. My name's Jonathan Crow, and welcome to Trim's ASMR chant. Wait, no, sorry. I'm hijacking this. <laughs> uh just, just as long as you just as long as you uh pay your tributes we're okay <laughs> and how's it going crow may Whoa. be a whore but it's not a good whore you need to get the cash first crow you're really bad at getting it yeah afterwards. yeah no i know i was gonna say crows known universally for stealing things <laughs> as he's trying to steal my stream no no <laughs> Ooh, shiny <laughs> I saw artwork and I had to have it. Yes. <laughs> hey, dude, make your own, bro. He is. I, I, I saw have. a preview the other day and it, it's super dark and gritty and emo crow murder death. Yeah, yeah I've got to <laughs> animate that as well somehow. Huh. Um, but I've been trying a new composition technique where usually I would use the rule of thirds because it's pretty much every time you use it, it looks pretty good. But this time I'm composing with the Fibonacci spiral. But yeah, I've never done that before. It's very interesting. I have no idea what you just talked about, so I'm just gonna nod and just I, I wish love you how luck. the artist knows neither the rule of thirds or the Fibonacci spiral. Nope. <laughs> so the Fibonacci sequence is a spiral resulting in halving your dimensions over and over again. So if you get a sixteen by nine page and then fold it in half and then fold it in half again. And then you draw a line from corner to corner of each box. You get a big spiral that looks like basic. It, it appears in nature all over the places, like in seashells and stuff. Oh. Um, and it's known as the golden ratio. Oh, I thought it was a thing from JoJo. Uh, no, uh, it's got a an actual mathematical thing. And that's um, how you can tell that Trim is a self-taught artist. <laughs> yes, oh, art no, I, I quote well. unquote artists. It's yeah. one of the the many things you can Shut do. Shut up, you're an artist. Using, uh, <laughs> photographs as well. Yep. Yeah. yeah, rule of thirds is in particular is really good for composing photos. Hmm. Yeah. It, it's the first thing you should learn, but you can use Fibonacci as well, and it's very difficult because most cameras don't come with a, an overlay of Fibonacci at all. Interestingly, I think my fucking phone does that. Hold on. It's right here. Let me check. Numidon, no, no. I was not actually making a JoJo reference. Honestly, that is a real thing. Go Google Fibonacci Spiral. <laughs> I love that, though. Reading. Uh, <laughs> okay, no, okay. This, good, this, you know. this app has grid lines. But yes, I do have grid lines for the rule of thirds <laughs> on the phone. <laughs> Yeah, the rule of yeah, thirds, but I thought it was just the rule of two. No, it's the power of three. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. I saw a preview for... <laughs> frigging... The, the, one of the, the Charmed remakes on Free to Air TV the other day. And literally, like, the first thing out of the black one's mouth 
I was assigned male at birth, but don't worry, it was just a mistake. I'm like, uh, kill me. I hate it whenever I see um, there's a company called Thriver, and they basically allow you to do blood tests. And um, I was gonna go and use their service and get myself some blood tests, you know, check if there's anything wrong with me. And I was like, okay, I have to answer these questions. And one of the first questions they asked me is what sex I was assigned at birth. And I was just like, no, no, not using your services. Bye. I'm giving my blood to a bunch of vampires. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> not giving my blood to people who can't figure out what an what a Y chromosome yeah. is. Yeah. <laughs> We're just going to take whatever we think it is between this and the 79 other fucking mental I issues on this tablet and just uh, hope we get the right one. And then we're just going to forge a story out of it because, you know, we all used to work in media. Well, there was that story about the guy who was going to donate blood and when they're like, you have to fill out the question that asks whether you're pregnant. He's like, um, fuck off. <laughs> Seriously? Yes. Oh god, this 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 planet, this fucking planet. Uh, primed us, isn't the human finger following the Fibonacci sequence? You know, I actually don't know. I was. I mean, I, I can see how you'd get, kind of get that, but I don't think the ratio's right. I mean, I don't think my finger folds in half over and over again infinitely. Because hmm. then well, that. In that case, I could unfold it infinitely too, which would be kind of cool. <laughs> I'm just getting these cool mental images while having no idea what the hell you guys are talking about. I, 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 don't, I don't, really don't think that the ratio of the bones quite adds up. Because it's it might... not halved again and again. It's close, but not quite, I don't. It might be close. I sent, um, for, for the weekly white pills, um, I sent a Fibonacci cat. <laughs> a Fibonacci cat? Yes, a cat rolled up in the Fibonacci spiral. <laughs> Cute. Cute. Honestly, it's almost perfect. Perfection. As if Magneto is standing uh, back in the background. The fingers do follow a, fi a Fibonacci sequence. Hmm. So they reckon. Today, <laughs> we're talking about the Fibonacci's. Next time, we'll talk about Bigfoot. <laughs> yeah. I've derailed it with Fibonacci. <laughs> it's alright. I have, I have no idea what any of this means. I, I did never take any sort of uh, art classes. So, you know. Or, or high school math either, by the sound of it. <laughs> no, I did take maths. It's just that I completely suck at it. I think you're confused. <laughs> Taking math isn't the same thing. Math. Huh. Math. Math. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, yeah, apparently the fingers do follow it. 1.618. Ooh. So there you go. It's kind of cool seeing your screen. It is? Thank you. I appreciate hearing that. No, I, I won't deny you. Seeing you doing your artwork really got me back into the headspace of wanting to do my own again. Yes! I haven't done it for years. I'll take that as personal victory. Yeah, student says, what sex do you identify with? My son says, I don't know, do you want to check and see if my penis is feminine or masculine? <laughs> I identify as whatever uh, gives me the most uh, fucking privileges and stuff. Yes. I'd also want to find out whether your penis follows the Fibonacci spiral, you know? <laughs> that sounds painful! From what I- what you've talk, uh, talked about- uh, talked about now just makes me think of a fucking weird spiral and I'm just getting, like, the Uzumaki version of a penis. <laughs> Thank yeah, you, Junior. I identify. It was adult way of saying I pretend to be. Yeah, I pretend to be a somewhat uh, decent uh, human being, but uh, we all know the truth. <laughs> I don't want to pretend to be. No. You just reached a point. I mean, you're Australian. You already reached a point where it's like, eh, no need to even fucking try. <laughs> Sorry. Exactly. Sorry. What's the point? Yeah. I'm pretending to not be evil. It's so easy when you're evil. <laughs> 
Which is a good song. Remember a song from the woman in white. Um, you can get away with anything as long as you have no shame. Hmm. So, like, my, Miley Annapolis? It is true. It is true. It's a brilliant, <laughs> brilliant song. Hmm. You're being called robots? Uh, we're Shrimp, we're apparently we need to go beat your CPU. <laughs> oh, god damn it. Beat that CPU. But it wasn't like this before, what the fuck has happened? They can't cope with right, the right. ASMR in the moment. Uh, <laughs> this is starting to annoy me a fair bit. What the fuck do you have running in the background on that computer, Dreamer? Nothing? Nothing, apparently. No, there's nothing. Try I mean, your task manager. Alright. Oh god, he's gone to the start menu. <laughs> Not a really technical kind of guy. Unless I've changed it, right click on the taskbar. Oh. Apparently you've gone back to normal. Oh god, they've changed it. <laughs> oh, oh, it's back to normal, they say. Yeah. Okay, so I like was having. Who knows? Windows might have been doing something stupid like an update in the background. Oh, uh, I haven't turned on. Uh, I haven't really restarted the PC in a while, so there might be some things that are being no, backed up. So yeah, uh, like fuck's sake, Windows. Like one of the things that Windows does that really annoys me is, why well, yes, we will do this resource-intensive thing while you're using it, not at four a.m. in the morning while you're asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Well, that would be helpful. Can't have that. Exactly. Let's see. Hmm. I'm just trying to figure out where to place the different colors. Fair enough. God dear. What are we gonna do with the trim? Snip Put a bolt in the back of his head? Snip it off? Okay. We must trim the trim. <laughs> <laughs> trim the trim. Yep. Snippy I snippy! Hear... I hear you saying that, but uh, I dare you to go over here and try. We'll send Disco. With a knife. He might enjoy that. <laughs> I mean, she might be armed with whatever, she's not real that threatening, to be honest. Prime9 asks, what's the worst type of update? The one that does two to three restarts or the one that takes two hours? The one that does both. <laughs> oh yeah, there we go. The one that two just makes me... restarts and, and four to six days. Man, I remember when I fucking <laughs> updated from Windows 9 to Windows... Uh, updated to Windows 10 the first time. Oh, no, no. Numadon says all Trim needs to do is stand on a table. He'll be safe until Disco finds the steppy stool. I've handled children, people, before. But have you handled a child with a knife? Surprisingly, yes. I mean, I've handled many children with knives. They die critty. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, that wasn't. Uh, yeah. I, I don't myself. think so. <laughs> I keep having uh, large, like motorbikes riding past the house that are very annoying. Ah. Mm. How dare they? There's this. Have you heard of piano wire? <laughs> Rot. Even better, you use magician's wire. Oh. <laughs> that way, they just puff out of existence. They don't get decapitated. They just. Poof. Like a <laughs> <laughs> oh lord so what kind of color should the irises be evil I think bright orange almost like a venomous yellowy orange you know mm. like you could start off with like a dark sclera and then make the irises progressively more yellow mm. make the pupil white so he's blind <laughs> I don't like blind, <laughs> but I do like the orange irises. Orange choice is cool. I always find oranges in a nice contrast to greens. Yes. 
Oh, yeah. oh. Speaking of color theory, it took me a long time to realize it after years and years of using Photoshop. But red, green, blue, if you invert it in things like Photoshop, is cyan, magenta, and yellow. Huh. That I makes had no sense. fucking idea. I was like, oh, it's the print colors. Why didn't I realize this? Hmm. I felt like a fucking idiot. I really did. I had no idea what you were even talking about, so you were all good in my book. <laughs> okay. okay. Well, <laughs> Trim, a light is additive color, and everything in the real world, like paint, is subtractive color. <laughs> I'm just going to nod, say yes, sir, and just hope you never ask me that again. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, pixels... <laughs> are made up of three tiny little diodes or something similar uh -huh. that are red green and blue and each one of those has 256 brightnesses including off <laughs> too technical zoning out Beep. <laughs> yeah, i think you pretty much fucking artists <laughs> <laughs> I think I lost him at numbers. Yes, you started mentioning a number above 10, and I was like, yeah, I'm up. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not getting paid enough for, for this shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you kind of are. <laughs> Where's the <laughs> money then? <laughs> what application are you using to do the drawing, by the way? Uh, I'm using Procreate. Really? Pro yes, oh. Procreate on the uh, iPad. Ah, nice. well, of course it's on the iPad, it's not on Android. No, because you so. can't get fucking Procreate on anything else but iPad, so I was like, mm. fuck, you twist my arm here. I've seen a few people use Procreate to do animations and all sorts of other stuff, so it's quite a cool little tool. Yes. Ah, Loki, you love it. There we go. Alright. Now, where the f Brick, should I place the pupils? It's <laughs> Jim history. Basic. Talks about colors at a scientific and technical level. Jim, I do a big time. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, where's the lie? Welcome to HTML. So, Trim. Yes. If you get red paint. No. And yellow paint. <laughs> no. And mix them together. <laughs> nope. Oh, the answer's brown, isn't it? It's brown, I bet. <laughs> it's always brown. Uh, oh, brown can be used for so much. You can mix any colors of paint and you will always end up with brown. <laughs> oh, man, that would suck. That would be a shit existence. <laughs> Nemodon says, Bezik, he's a chef. Use cooking analogy. <laughs> <laughs> I <laughs> so you, you, if you take ketchup and mix it with mustard, you, you get, get a brown abomination. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord, <laughs> smart ass. <sighs> Shall we start talking about electron tubes? Uh, you can start talking about it, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to follow like at all. Well, you didn't follow the pixels are made of green. <laughs> no. No, I didn't. Weird. Huh. <laughs> Fuck's sake. <laughs> He's got a fucking color wheel on screen right now. <laughs> yeah. Wait, he does. What? Also square. And lines. And this. And another ring. Look. Red, green, blue. Look yeah. at all the pretty colors. Yeah, but here's the fun thing. I don't need to know shit about it. Just I just need to be able to use it. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, suffer. Just think how much you could do if you knew things. Yeah, but you know. When you're getting used to being in the position you are, it's like, eh, comfy. Right, so, white 
<laughs> is made up of all the colors of the rainbow. <laughs> I thought it was uh, the color of supremacy, but okay. Ooh, actually, but that's a good point for what. Where was it? Prime Knight says, I remember Carl's take on the prior flag being served just with colors. A true pride flag would be put brown. No, no, no. When you add all the colors of the rainbow together, you get white. So a true pride flag would be white. Well, that really depends if you're talking about pigment versus light. Light together makes white, but pigments together make black. <laughs> yes. Uh, well, so if you get both, if you're doing both at the same time, you could just make a gray flag. Gray <laughs> flag of ambiguity. That's what it should be. We neither well, have positive nor negative feelings towards anything. We should we should we should send it to the printer as RGB two five five two five five two five five, and then the printer will just look at us like we're insane. What about thirteen fifty seven? No. <laughs> I wonder what it would do if you put white in for CMYK, whether it would make it slightly grey or something. I mean, I know there are places that can print white when you're printing onto th things other than white paper, but I, I can also imagine that the printer would look at you like you're mad. Mm. Next question, what's the CMYK value for white? <laughs> Probably zeros across the board. This yeah. thing got real fucking yeah, technical this today. Like across the board. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's hash, F, 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 F. <laughs> yes, zero percent everything. It's a hundred percent light. Okay, CMYK values for uh, white is zero across the board. Yeah, unsurprisingly. And apparently... So how... What? Next question is, how do you print nothing? <laughs> And for pure black, it's 100 across the board for CMYK. <laughs> That's interesting. Uh, yeah, you need a alpha transparency layer for printing nothing. Yeah. So, I'm hoping my next part of my lighting setup is going to be a tube light to go behind me. Very then, nice. Then I can set it green. When are you going to start uh, playing Final Fantasy, by the way? Uh, very soon. I'm working wow. on an intro and outro animation for my YouTube channel first. Yes. I've worked on the artwork a bit. I'm kind of making progress on that, too. You still keep on going with the whole, I want it to be perfect, while me and Bess is like, let's just throw at a wall. <laughs> I, I've obviously done YouTube in the past, and, you know, I've you know, thrown myself at the wall randomly like that. And I prefer having everything planned out. It's mm. a personal preference. Yeah. Uh, one of these days, I need to put together an, an, an animation. Problem is, coming with an idea, then animating it. <laughs> yeah, I know the feeling. Uh, yes, Junior History says, Printer, error 404, dick stuck in taster. <laughs> I, I think that when we poll. Trim, See you later, Numadon. Bye, Numadon. Bye, Numadon. Now, what was that about abusing me again, Basic? If we ping trim, we get a 418 response. If anyone in chat knows, I'm just waiting to see if anyone in chat knows what that is off the top of their heads before I tell you what it is. I don't know that I understood what you said. That one flew over my head. But like he knew so that. You know how you get the, the HTTP error 404 page not found? Yeah. I'm suggesting that trim would return a 4818. Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> I don't see that one very often. No. <laughs> so you do know what it is? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no, you said 418, and I was like, I'm not quite sure. And then, let's see, again. Oh. Nah. No trim. Four zero four does not is not system not responding. I think system not responding is a five. Eh, I have the excuse that I have no idea what the hell any of this means, so you know. 
<laughs> history liked it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but it, I'm, it is so broken that I can't even use the wrong code. <laughs> well, that's... Like, I'm certain that's a 500. <laughs> <laughs> For the record, a 418 is I'm, an, I'm a teapot. Ah. <laughs> Instead of like 404 page not found, it's 418, I'm a teapot. Very confusing. <laughs> Makes it Americans is. scream in fear because they fear the tea. I like yes. the way you put 404 system not responding. That's not it. I know. <laughs> I have, yeah, but there's uh, again nothing there. So it's not responding. <laughs> <laughs> don't try to get technical with me. I don't know shit on this guy. Jesus. <laughs> I'm a luddite. Is that a word for it? Yes, though luddites at least know that technology exists. I know the technology exists, I'm just so terrified of it that I'm probably going to try to set it on fire one day. Ah, uh, uh, yes, printer errors. On fire. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Let's see, uh, what out, what other HTTP status codes would Trim return? Hmm. What wouldn't I return? <laughs> yes, a 451. The hell's a four Unavailable for legal reasons. <laughs> <laughs> Chosen as a reference to the novel Fahrenheit 451. <laughs> I still haven't I still haven't read that novel yet. Uh dear. Has anyone read the uh, Fahrenheit uh... Has anyone read Fahrenheit? I kind of want to try it out, but never seem to have taken time. <laughs> oh, dear. Let's see. It's gonna be interesting seeing how this one turns out because this is the first time I draw something with this much hair on it. Student history says I saw a car accident video the other day where the car was GPS speaking right after the crash and everything stops moving the car. Impact got protected. <laughs> Ooh. Well, maybe that was just uh, me from the future. Time traveling uh, Terminator style. Turn into a car and just completely do my thing. Impact detected two years after impact. Surely the GPS should turn around and say, You have reached your final destination. <laughs> Are you dead yet? Uh, Good. Okay. Well, let's see. Hmm. There are ways to do this. However, am I doing it right? That's the question. Did my um my joke about the error go in the chat at all? Because can sometimes error six one six Satan has found you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> sometimes I find that I'll comment on people's chats and it literally just doesn't show up at all hmm. yeah some t especially if they've got set to top chat for some reason it just hides crap which is annoying i wish live chat was the priority that'd be much easier yeah so like oh great. top chat always top chat mm -hmm. dude i want to talk to as many people oh, as possible oh, oh. speaking mm -hmm. of chats have you seen the What's included in the basis for version 18 of OBS Crow? Sorry, say that again? Version 18 of OBS. Have you seen what's included coming out in that? Because they've got a beta version of it out now. I haven't, no. 
Like, well, for one thing, they fixed the chat so you can actually send messages from OBS now on YouTube. Oh, that's bloody useful. Bloody useful. Hmm. They've Is also... It a studio, I assume. Yeah, OBS Studio. <laughs> on the okay. GitHub, of course. They've also got... It's now built into Studio. Application-specific audio capture. Ooh. Oh, that's actually very useful, yeah. Yeah, I've been using a plugin for that, You're but now it's just baked in, which is very handy. Love it when it's no, handy. I was, trying, I was trying to do things like source record, but it's just not going to work for 4K footage on this computer. Mm -hmm. um, I literally, I've tried it, and although I can, for some reason, I actually managed to record 4K lossless for uh, one of the games I was playing, um, but the file size was so fucking massive five seconds well it's a bit of an exaggeration it was about two minutes of footage but it was about 10 gigabytes yeah so i need a bigger hard drive bigger faster you, you want to talk about that let me let me bring up let me have a look at the file size to bloody sultans <laughs> yeah. so you keep all the po podcasts so you can re-upload them later don't you uh, I've been doing less of that. <laughs> yeah, it gets to a point where I, it's impossible to do. Yeah. Oh, actually, no, that's reasonably decent sizes. I must be saving at something else. 7.56 gig for six hours. <laughs> so, <laughs> the um, chat. Um, that's tiny. <laughs> <laughs> Topless chat is better. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Uh, Shirts. The, the unfect the audio. Yeah, yeah uh, we're, we're slowly trying to encourage Bleach to get into it as well. Yeah. My big thing is I want to get. Good enough history is going to be doing a. I think it's. Is it Studio or Prime? It's one of them. <laughs> I always. One of them is uh, doing Boohers and they're going to start doing a YouTube channel. Hey. Where they're going to hit things with swords. Lovely. Um, okay, no, that wasn't what I wanted to. Let me go check. The recordings for the power washing stream, which was about two and a half hours. Yeah, there we go. That's more like it. Two hours forty three minutes. Thirty one point six gigabytes later. <laughs> Oof. And that's just at ten eighty. Three sixty five forty. You mean like trim streams? <laughs> Ah, yeah, yeah, I see the Fibonacci. Very nice. What are you using? Clip Studio Paint X. Technically, there's two Fibonacci. Hmm. <laughs> oh, very nice. Smart ass. <laughs> I still have no idea what's being talked about, so I'm just gonna nod. Nod. Let's go. The thing is, when I do my YouTube stuff, I want to try and create some really cool deep lore. Mm. Uh, so like a VTuber. No. Well, one... <laughs> well, ooh, yes, but that crow is, looks very cool. And should mm. totally fly in and land on the tree. Well, actually, it's probably going to be sat on the tree first. This is like the establishing shot for the scene. Oh, right, eh? Um, And then it was going to slowly have the moon change colour to a red and then it was going to cut into a prop shot of the crow also having it by turn red and then the next shot is a hand bursting out of the tomb or the grave <laughs> um, but I'm just trying to draw a rough idea of each scene because it's going to be even more detailed when I actually animate it uh, Best like student of history has a question for you about the uh, weight loss channel weight loss. do I just drop my white waist in the relevant channel yep just drop it in there Oh, is that actually open now? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck yeah. I it's called what, something weird because it was the best thing we could find. <laughs> is that probably why I can't find it? Yeah, probably. Yeah, yeah I literally don't see it. <laughs> no. yeah. Oh, wait. We should have one called Lotus Dieters instead of Lotus Eaters. Yeah. 
<laughs> I've pinged you in it. Oh, what the fuck is that one? What? <laughs> I, uh, one of the boys named it at the Sultan's Wasteline Attack Tracking. <laughs> also known as SWAT. Uh, hold oh, on. Man, there's a lot of posts already, Jesus. <laughs> if I rename it to SWAT Fats. <laughs> Well, we should hope Tim Pool doesn't have to join because, oh boy, it's going to be a wrong kind of swanning. <laughs> I think he gets enough, enough <laughs> spreading in his life. <laughs> I mean, when he reaches the point where he's like, ah, let's just get going, guys. <laughs> well, just I like what I see so far. <laughs> Fatty's losing weight and shining each other. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a good, it's a good motivator. I've got to work on this piece too, Baz. Mm -hmm. That one is going to become Ooh, channel art. That is nice. It's also going to become a tattoo for that matter, which is why I've put so much work into it. I am unable to show any of this for the stream, by the way, so... I know, don't worry, I'm just showing you guys. Sorry. I like the idea that it's being a little anonymous. Let's <laughs> see, you're just uh, hyping up for yourself so you can uh, oh, get okay. everyone excited. Yeah, the other thing this this particular crow I was thinking would be good for is if I create merchandise, because uh, I like the idea of I don't like the idea of having merchandise that isn't cool to look at. Like I don't want just some T-shirt that has John Crow written on it and be like, oh yeah, look, it's me. You support me. That's fucking egotistical nonsense. I'm just like, no, I made big cool crow. You like big cool crow? We're big cool crow. Yes. Speaking of which, that reminds me. I need to stick some some more trims. Art on the bloody channel. Mm. Oh, by the way, this is how I do animations. Uh, so I have this. Oh, it's kind of looking a bit weird because I'm. I'm used to working in 4K, so it's a little bit weird looking. So I apologize. You are I used to the higher qualities of life. I haven't heard of Clip Studio Paint X either. Yeah, I use some pretty cool stuff. Let me just switch which broadcaster I'm using. Which screen? Prime says he's starting Boo Herd and is considering starting a channel for his journey into it. Absolutely mm. should. Alright. We need we need more based content. Yeah. So this, <sighs> oh, nice. actually, I'm this this is a um vector based animation software. Um, vector based. Okay, yep. now now you've got my attention. <laughs> Very nice, but vector based, you say? Yeah, that's yep. absolutely got my attention. <laughs> so it's it's very much like um, Flash, animation style stuff. Um, but I did I used this for a while to make a lot of different things. Um, let's have a look. I've got some random ones in here. This one's probably from my business. Yeah, <laughs> this is one of the bits of artwork I actually use for my company. Cool doesn't look very good because you have to actually render out the pieces um, <laughs> but yeah once they're rendered they look pretty decent um, but yeah that's that's a m version of myself as a cleaner with the wearing my apron as a cape <laughs> <laughs> there we go it's sad that my first thought is the hair's wrong <laughs> <laughs> I know I know because I've grown my hair out now Anyway, I shall stop being distracted. Uh, Prime says he just worries about copyright and using footage taken in public. Oh, eh, uh, yeah. You're in the somewhere in Europe, aren't you? No, wait. Hold on. Is Pro I think Prime's the Swede. <laughs> I'm so bad at remembering people. I think Prime's Sorry. the Swede, yeah. 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 I've got no idea what the laws are like in Sweden. I, I not, I've got a vague idea in England, America, and obviously Australia, but eh. Copyright, though, I'm pretty sure anywhere in Europe except France, if you film it, you, you're fine as far as copyright goes. Oui, oui, we Europe have got weird ass privacy rules. No, hon hon? Fucking, the fucking Hon Hons, like, 
You can't, you literally can't film the Eiffel Tower at night and upload it on YouTube because that you can't even take a picture of something that's in copyright in France. And the Eiffel Tower is copyrighted? No, the lighting on it at night is copyrighted. The Eiffel Tower is too old. That doesn't make any sense. Only in France. Copyright lighting. Yeah, but because the lighting is a cre unique creative work, <laughs> it's still in copyright. Mm. Well, that's the Frenchies for you. Yeah. But yeah, as far as copyright goes, you're probably almost certainly fine. <laughs> but yeah, I have no idea what the privacy rules are like. Let's see how this goes. I really wish. I wish YouTube would fix the bloody theatre mode. It should be theatre mode with the chat to the right, so you can look at the fucking thing in full screen and still see chat. That'd be fucking nice. Rather than chat fucking off violently. <laughs> it like launches itself at the floor. Yeah. fear. <laughs> Prime says, "Bye, sweet. Bye, sweet. Remember that." <laughs> and Bleach says, "Damn frogs." I mean, there are so much cancer that's come from France. It doesn't really surprise me that they just do shit like this. I much prefer Belgium. But I disavow their colonial uh, days. Close enough. Ah, colonial days are based. Eh, not oh, there. No, not the Belgium ones. They were just un cruel and unusual. The British colonial <laughs> days, on the other hand, much better. The Brits had this thing called claws and pizzazz. Whatever the fuck <laughs> pizzazz means. I think it means class. Oh. Well, then, see, double class. I thought it was like a bit of spark and show. Mm, well, maybe. An attractive combination of vitality and glamour. Well, see? there you go. They did the thing. They had the thing. Oh. He showed me his glamour and his vitality. I was very pizzazzed. Yeah, Prime <laughs> says if you stand on public land and can use a handheld camera to take photos, it should be fine. Drone footage is gone, people arrested. Drone footage, it depends, yeah, that kind of makes sense depending on the drone footage because generally in most countries, you can film anything you can see from public land without magnification. So, for example, I can stand on the street and do a 360 panorama and it's fine, but if I stand on the street and zoom into someone's window, that's a crime. Which seems reasonable, about as reasonable as it gets for the, anything the government does. Yeah, or the Frenchies, in that sense. I mean, in France, you are tend to be guilty until proven innocent. So. It's not usually all of Europe. Just saying. Yeah, basically. Maybe. Let's see, that's a soft light. I'm just fucking around a bit, seeing what sticks, what works. <laughs> what do you guys think about this? What exactly did you just do? Uh, it looks too flat and shiny. Yeah. I think your biggest problem at the moment is you need to pick a source of light. Hmm. Because we don't, like, because the location where the light comes from dictates where the shadows fall, it also allows you to develop that 3D shape. And it's a very, very difficult thing to do. It like takes a lot of practice. Yeah. I really got into that part. Need to learn it. Let's see. The the easiest thing to do, I find, is just pretend that there is a global illumination from the top center of the screen and just light everything from there initially. Mm -hmm. You draw all the reflections in the basically 
in response to that. Um, it's not the easiest thing to do, mind you. Like, I, I have so much trouble doing it, even on my own art, so... Um, it's a lifelong practice, so don't feel bad if it, it seems hard initially. It's hard. Dude, I'm not, e I'm not even amateur, so, you know, just, uh, I'm taking whatever no, no, I can get. No, no. That's all right. The thing with art is you can be at any level, and there's always people who are going to be better than you and worse than you. But there's always things you can learn and improve, and that's one of the things I love about it. I mean, it's one of the reasons why I'm doing this. Hopefully to improve. Let's see. Let's see. Nope, my audio has completely died. Yay! What? <laughs> my audio's died, and so have I. Oh no. <laughs> Don't leave me alone. She has zombie audio. Ah. Is my audio fucked up again? Uh, I will check. Playing up. I think it might be. No, bears and I sound okay. Lovely. Well, there's something less to worry about, at least. Well, yeah. Let's see. I think I need to figure out how the light hits the the fur, uh, the wool of this creature. Um, whenever I'm un unsure, I just most likely just do one of these and then just delete around it just to see if I make it fit, you know? It ain't a perfect system, but eh, it at least does something. I don't know all the tools available in Procreate. It's one of the reasons I do like using Clip Studio is it comes with a bunch of um, high quality different brushes. I, I mostly use what they call a G pen, which is a Japanese drawing pen. Um, there's all sorts of things like textured pens, pastels, pencil. They've got watercolor, gouache, <laughs> like all sorts of replication. And um, because I've got a Cintiq uh, tablet that I use. Uh, oh, I don't. Actually... I don't plan on using Cintiqs. They're just too much of a headache. Oh, and they make drawing a lot easier if you can actually draw what you can see, but they're a very expensive investment. I mean, my investment was this uh, tablet. I primarily used this only for drawing, so... This wasn't Twitter yeah, shit no, posting. No. A lot of people actually get into the drawing with the tablet, um, especially the Apple products. It's quite... Um, a, a solid investment if you want to start playing around with that kind of thing. Um, one of my favorites, personally. Hmm. I mean, it's the only reason I have this goddamn Apple thing. I'm just playing around on my screen with um, the thin gouache cool. brush. And you can just slowly layer things together and you get kind of a nice texture. Depends on what you want to achieve though. This is also true. like oil, oil style paints, um, which are odd. <laughs> um, they can also like blend with each other yeah, pointillism brushes and stuff. Uh, oh. You usually use the pointillism one with an already existing paint to create texture like this. I am not watching your screen, so I'm just busy watching my own. If 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 I if I if I stop uh, if I start watching your stream I won't be able to do anything on my own side, so I guess that would kind of defeat the entire point. <laughs> Sorry. 
<laughs> yeah, no, 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 no. I'm just saying. I do not possess. I do not possess the ability to multitask. You can see Bezik how that creates a really furry texture already. Yeah. Quite nice. Furry, is it? Yeah, is it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna have to leave the stream now because I mentioned furries. No, not that. <laughs> I just uh, want you to go through that with me one day. It's mostly down to the tool. It literally, it, it's like a pointillism tool, so it, it creates multiple points and then kind of drags them out, so it ends up looking like fur. Hmm. Um, it's quite helpful. Uh, it's not so helpful if you're doing a crow, because everything has to look feathery, so mm. that's still working in different techniques. But Sounds like a pain. Uh, it can also use those kind of things for blending as well. So uh, It depends on the, the tools you use. I don't know all the tools available in Procreate, unfortunately. I mean, what I'm using, most of the tools I use now are uh, taken from a pack me and Bessic found and downloaded. Usually they're the best. But there's a lot of them that cost money, and I don't really have the money to do that. Unfortunately. Oh, I know, I know. I've made the mistake of spending money on packs in the past, and then they've not been updated to be compatible with certain softwares. Mm -hmm. um, thankfully, this app actually has everything built in. You can get extras if you want, but it's not necessary to do good artwork. Hmm. Uh, and most of the artwork I do is very, very stylized anyway, and usually it's just um, preparing for another program to do it differently. So, for example, the work I've been doing today is going to go into Moho Studio as a background, and then I will animate it separately with numerous layers, which is also going to be a pain in the ass, I realize. Oh, dear. <laughs> yeah, I remember it took me a month just to make a short animation for Yami Mesh. Actually, I wonder how long it was. Perfect, but I guess it'll do. Maybe. I think the whites are a little too white. The whites? Yeah, it lo looks way too shiny. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, something more like that. Because otherwise, it looks like you've sprayed fucking clear coat on a goat. Right. I don't plan to have it like this. Uh, I always use the <laughs> added to either do like, you know. Just slightly, just slightly. And also, you have the soft light, and you can just drag that one. <laughs> it's a real bitch to get. But it's fun to play around with and figure out what to do. So... I'm thinking 10% on the add, which is, add is basically just turn it all to light, as light as possible. Yeah, about that. Let's see. Ah, that wasn't good. Maybe 12? What do you think? When you see it? I'm trying to put... But I need to wait for it to catch up. Sorry. I think... I, I you... re still reckon less, but... Less? I reckon if you put it like that and added an additional layer for highlights. Yeah. And then you basically only highlight the very top of things or something like that. Like um, the top oh, of the ears try the head. I'm gonna try something out here. I should do this. No, I'm gonna do this. Like that. Do it. A little bit funny. I like the shine. But it doesn't look nice when you try to work around it. I 
smudging tool is really fun. I've started trying to use it a bit more now. Yeah, people with women tend not to get a nice time in prison usually. Good. <laughs> get what they bloody deserve. Nice. Yeah. As it should be. Indeed, as it should be. I remember a story in Sweden where a uh, priest, a family accused their daughter to be a witch, so they got a priest. And uh, he just sent, put nails through her hands and constantly asked her how many children had she eaten. What the fuck? This happened a few years ago, but still, pretty fucked. I was going to ask him how many he had eaten. <laughs> Hmm. It's like considerably famous. more by the sounds of it. What a fucking monster. Alright. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. No. I do this like soft light put it 69 for the mean yeah oh, that's a hell of a lot better yeah and then I try like this but I ah, it doesn't work the way I want it damn it <laughs> it's always the way yeah, because it's like this. If put it there, if I max it out, it becomes like this. But put it in sixty nine there, it it blends in a bit. Doesn't get too powerful. Let's see, I need to try to get. Let's see, I just work like that. Damn it. keep getting points where I, with artwork, I just get a complete stumbling block where I'm not sure what to do next. What? I'm Sorry. Not... <laughs> I get to a point where I get to a stumbling block where I'm not sure what to do next. Ah. I mean, there's a reason why I have a lot of projects open at the same time, because if I get stumbling one, I just jump onto other, another one. Like, trying to create a background design for things is one of the hardest things I have. So I'm like, I don't know what I don't want to see, but still need to be there. <laughs> Alright, what if I do this? Okay, that was a little better. What do you guys think? Get in there. Yeah. Get in there. It, it looks less like someone's sprayed six slides of clear coat on a guy. That's the point. No, Have you worked I... out which direction you want light to travel from? Not at all. I'm just going with the flow right now. Fair. <laughs> there we go. But I guess from the point here that it's somewhere up here-ish. Again, I need a lot of practice. So... It does oh, look like that would be a good point. Huh? Sorry, what did you say, Bez? <laughs> Almost as if that's what he's doing. Yeah, no, right. You know, practicing. weird. <laughs> Practice? The fuck is this heresy? Let's see. Well, a little bit off on this one. Let's see. Maybe seventy-five there. Sixty-nine. If I do it like this, does this look uh, decent for you guys? Fine. Too many. Hmm. I wanted to try it out. We'll see how it turns out. Let's see.
Oh, it wasn't any nails in the hand. All right. Yeah, Congo family, of course. Yep. Ah, the joys of inclusivity. Exactly. Oh, such is life. Swedes have it hard. <laughs> but they do. Yeah. Swedes have it hard because they got to deal with the Swedes. <laughs> it does make it harder, doesn't it? It does. Hmm. Maybe. Team will show. Did you guys see the uh, Petter Solberg thing I sent yesterday on the Sultans? In the Discord? The what? Uh, essentially, we started talking about the difference, uh, the different ways uh, uh, dialects and accents sounds with, uh, from other languages, and it's just... If you gotta take people who are Norwegian and have a really bad grip of English, it is really funny hearing them speak. Cause they yeah, we know. Yeah, they sound the same. dealing with you in the ages now. Oh, I have actually pretty good English compared to the average Norwegian. But if you want, I can actually speak like uh, one of uh, the average uh, people. Is that okay? Yeah, that is fine with us. Uh, maybe. Then we don't uh, speak yeah. like that. We also uh, uh, like some uh, Norwegian words. Some Norwegian word to make it uh, easier for uh, us to understand what the hell we are talking about. You don't make any sense in when you're speaking English anyway. Exactly. And now it's even worse. Making sense, says the Australian. <laughs> yeah. At least I speak the Queen's English like a real man. You speak a convict's English, though. No, I speak the Queen's English. Mm -hmm. Well, at least it's not. God save the Queen, Royal Britannia. One of the American friends, uh, sorry, Australian friends that my brother had when we were out in Australia thought that the Australians invented English. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you meant like that. Hmm. May maybe they did, because it could be that the guy who invented England was thrown to the uh, Australian colonies. Oh. Yes, no. yes, no. yes, yes. No! With the platypus when, and the drop bears. When, when, when Crow lived in Australia, there were people alive that remembered when the fucking country was founded. <laughs> <laughs> it's I, I'm funny. pretty sure I didn't have that time frame right, too. Australia is the young Crow country. Gotta be late 20s by now. Early 30s? 31 uh, in, well, a couple of weeks. Huh. Welcome to the 31 club soon. Yeah. <laughs> I still haven't got kids. It's ridiculous. What's wrong with me? <laughs> so, Membership yeah, is lifetime. Last for a year. <laughs> so, Crow's Just... 31, so yeah. You were a kid in, when you were in Australia. So yeah, there would have been people alive that remembered Federation. <laughs> Not many, but they would have been. <laughs> Was it a good federation? Do no. you remember the Commonwealth? Ah, uh, finally. Let's see how this turns out, eh? I am just playing at the moment. That's okay. We Yanks at least speak corrupt Shakespearean English. <laughs> oh ye doth say with the thingy on the thingy. 
<laughs> I mean, I just thought they sp spoke hamburgers. You're a strange thing. <laughs> hey, leave them a thing. I could have been a non-entity. You might be at this right. Eh, still alive. <laughs> He's gonna gulag you. <laughs> you can't gulag me. There's not enough room. The non-entity. <laughs> There's not enough room in the gulag. Because when I go out to get the mail, it measures on director scale. The word is out, but it treat me right, because I'm the king of cellulite. <laughs> God. <laughs> that, that was supposed to be a weird owl, but he butchered it so fucking badly. Well, I remembered everything perfectly. I just were, wasn't going to sing it because I don't want to risk getting fucking but, but, Yeah, but that was worse than your normal fucking voice. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> An absolute success. I fail upwards. Uh, no. Because I never succeed, so I might just try fail fail the opposite direction. And if I fail, well, I fail. Definitely Your fail. Will kill. What? Yeah. Sorry. I... Someone likes Forge and Fire. <laughs> <laughs> Have you heard there's a D and D movie coming out? What? Yeah, there's what a D and D. A D and D movie is in production. Oh, God. It's been a D&D movie. Yeah, it's going to be a new one. What's the point? Probably to represent V5 and how inclusive V5 is. You know, the wheelchair? Nah. If, oh. if they don't have the wheelchair, I'll be disappointed. Also, considering Wizard of the Coast, there's probably going to be a little bit of the, you know... There's gonna be some kind of maps there, but it's not the usual kind of maps. <laughs> kind of fun. Let's see. It's kind of hard trying to paint similar style to somebody else. Sim similar style to somebody else? Mm, I'm basically doing your artwork. Oh. Trying to reimagine it, but also keep it similar. Well, then you need to find someone who actually has a style, you know. No, no, no. Yeah, it's always fun looking at other people's work and practicing their own stuff. It's cool. Well, that's the best way to actually learn. I mean, I I learned drawing by uh, tracing. Yeah, that's pretty much how you do it, though. Yep. Yeah. I didn't take any fancy schools and other things like that. I just doodled. Yes, we noticed when we you didn't know what additive and subtractive colors were. Maybe we have different words for it in Norway. We don't, you know. You probably don't know those either. I don't know. You gotta, you know, we gotta try it. Uh... <laughs> oh, I'm having fun. I'm having fun. Let's see. I'm just enjoying the opportunity to play around. That's good. I'm actually <laughs> distracting myself from my own artwork. <laughs> you tend to do that, don't you? <laughs> you just yeah, hear you I just hear the crow. Finish me! Finish me! And they're like, no. I don't want. Uh, you're a problem, Jim. Always have been, always will be, until the day I meet the sweet release of death. <sighs> I can't come fast enough. And when that day does eventually come, let's say a bomb goes off and you get encompassed in the blast, you'll just be like, ah, nice. <laughs> yeah. Uh, like he says. I don't want to know it coming because I don't want to die that way. So you know, it's like, eh, let, let it be a surprise. I prefer surprises. Oof. Oh, and 
I think the worst ones I've seen, like someone's decided to jump off a roof to kill themselves and unfortunately landed on someone. <laughs> There's some pretty nasty oh. ones like that out there. Mm. That I got, man. Jesus. <laughs> I'm going somewhere dark. Someone with you, you son of a bitch. I'm, take, I'm taking this one off. It's a bit too dark for the mood. Let's see. Do do do. So since there's no sultans tomorrow, me and uh, James Kraken are Kraken. I'm really bad with his name. We're gonna be doing a small stream tomorrow. Talk a little bit about the process of uh, how he writes and stuff, and I'm just gonna ask him, if him whatever question comes up, pops up in mind. Very nice. Sounds good. I will shill it in the uh, usual channels. Yes. Well, that would be clever, wouldn't it? Yes. No, don't shill it. Don't tell anyone you're doing anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> Fine, if you don't want to see it. Okay, I get it. I get it. <laughs> Let's see. Hey, John. Uh, Crow. Mm -hmm. When you... You know when it's like you draw, but then you have like a drought period where you don't do anything remotely artistic? Yeah. Yeah, how long has the, your longest period been? Ooh. Hard to say, probably like six, seven years or something like that. Mm. Well, actually, let me think. 2015, I stopped doing YouTube, and it's now 2022, so nearly, nearly seven years. I'd say. Ooh. Well, better late than never. Welcome back. Yeah. It's good to do something with my time. Yeah. Longest one I've had was uh, three to four years. Oh, that's not good. Yeah, three to four years is not too bad, considering. Mm. Um, I mean, that was from sure. going to draw every single day and then suddenly just losing all just will and wish to keep going. So just like, eh, fuck it. Yeah, that's fair enough, though. No, I am not currently sure if I actually am going to be going out tonight at this point. No? The plan seems to have changed. Oh. Yeah, this is unfortunate, but, you know, things happen. Such is life. It's fine if they don't want to be my friend. <laughs> if I care. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. We understand that position. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you couldn't look at it like this. At least you're not me. I mean, I do sometimes wonder that I'm forcing myself upon people uh, but my parole right. officer says I'm good no, I'm <laughs> <laughs> uh. I measure my social social interaction by uh, the amounts of restraining orders I have <laughs> I haven't got enough I need to work harder at this point, it's a competition. <laughs> I will become the primary friend of everyone. Whether they want to or not. <laughs> there we go. Okay, I, I think I'm done painting this now. I want to see it afterwards. Uh, it's nothing. I mean, I want to see it still, though. Just, I'll send it to you. Yay! Very good. 
When I was a kid, I had this little dream where I would make my own comic or some kind of uh, story where I could like write the story self, uh, myself and then draw some images for it. But that story, that dream has slowly been dying off. I was originally got into uh, art and stuff because I was trying to draw my own comic book. <laughs> but I was actually drawing really crap manga style stuff, so. <laughs> Why not? Well, I mean, I was into manga, you know. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, just look at what Marvel has shat out the last few years. It's it can't be worse than that. <laughs> yeah, have they paying people hundreds of thousands of dollars for what? <laughs> well, yeah. Oh Jesus Christ! I mean, uh, as far as artwork style goes, you know, I've got a, a good amount of experience, but it just takes me so long to actually like anything I draw that it takes so long over it. Oh, I sent it across with you. Like, look at it later. Yes. That's a bitch about actually making something, and first, if you actually feel pride about it when you're done, but then you look at it again and you just see all the fucking mistakes you made. Oh, tell me about <laughs> it. Every time I open up that bloody crow I'm doing as a tattoo, I'm like, I don't like it. <laughs> the foot <laughs> is wrong. Why are those fucking feathers there? Oh dear. <laughs> Poor cry. I mean, I quite like, um, I, I like the idea of doing a very painterly style comic book when I was doing it. I think I still have them somewhere. Cool. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I think I do actually, yeah. I don't know. Well, I'm not hating this, though. It'll be interesting to see how it turns out. Estonian president crowd surfed at Folk Festival? <laughs> Lovely. The guys behind Ripovers is at least trying to bring back comics that it used to be. I hope the guy can just restart the fucking golden age of comics again. Oh god, that'd be fun. They're getting nice. Mm hmm. I mean, three million and counting, so he's doing something right. <laughs> not being completely and utterly shit by then, it seems to be all you need. Yeah, or, you know, not force crap politics into your works. It's like, I, I, <laughs> I, I want to make a good story. It's like, okay, so what else? No, it's just going to be a good story. Okay, take my money. <laughs> you what? <laughs> Who the fuck are you? <laughs> So let me get this straight. You're not going to force your politics into my into your work. Mate, I yes. don't even want to touch your children. <laughs> Take my money. Take my money. Oh, the that money. Drown him in money. And the best part is, they doesn't let it go to his head. I just realized my art style hasn't really changed much at all. <laughs> <laughs> Looking Whoops. at my alt. That's my old comic, first page on the left. Jesus. Well, I like the colors, actually. I didn't finish the pages, you can probably tell. Well, it's never too late. Well, I'm... the story's not worth telling anymore. Who knows? Moreover, I'm an adult now, and it feels a bit childish. Hmm. Quote, unquote, adult. I'm wondering whether I could animate it in a painted style like this. It might be a bit difficult, though. Hmm. I'd have to paint everything, and then set them up as individual PNG layers, and then animate them on top of each other. 
which I could do, but it's very time consuming. Mm. We'll work it out somehow. Mm. I believe in you. Oh, damn it. I've made that mistake before. <laughs> Fun seeing how it turns out. Nah. This part is gonna drive me insane. Are you trying to pretend that you weren't insane to start with? Well, I mean, considering the kind of a lion, I would say you probably could get away with using much smaller strokes that are not really long. As a fur is shorter, that probably yeah. will help you get the shading. You could add all the texture again to the main, but like limit the texture on the body and just use shading. Hmm. I want to have some hair looks, you know. So you can see the hairs on a bit, at least a bit. I want to try to see if I can get the illusion there. It might work, it yeah. might not work, it might be a train wreck. Who I mean, I've, I did pretty much the same thing you did, where most of the actual um, furry or featheriness of the crow that I did is based on the actual line work. Um, that, that tends to be what does it. Like this? Well, you've already got lots of lines and you've got lots of scribbly bits where there's open and stuff which looks very which that's pretty much what most um better artists than myself seem to do um which is why i try to replicate it and um just leave the shading to be more shaded rather than thinking about the texture too much really oh. you'd be surprised well i think this guy his name is false knees he does a bunch of sort of bird artwork watercolor style Absolutely fantastic artist. I really like his work. You probably appreciate it too, I think. Oh, mind sending me? Yeah, yeah, I'll send you a link. Lovely. Let's see. This thing. I want to try and do the same thing with the line as I did with the goat. Just have the lines and then make them a bit weaker. I just want to see how it looks. I mean, it's worth a shot. Anyway. I don't remember what your Twitter account is. Huh? What's your Twitter account? Uh, I don't use that one publicly. Uh -huh. I don't want to have a Twitter account publicly connected to anything because I hate social media. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. I'm just trying to find a way to send it to you easily. Uh, just send it to Discord. Yeah. yeah. Let's see. I uh, sorry for not sorry for not being so very conversational today. Sorry. Stop fucking apologizing, Jim. I can't help it. Fucking. I personally feel aggrieved by all the apologies. Ah shit. <laughs> I did it again. Now I'll be cancelled. I'll be cancelled. <laughs> Got the 
point where people just stop, uh, tell me to stop apologizing because I apologize way too much. This is the opposite from the SGW effect. Apologize! Like, stop apologizing. <laughs> Uh, fuck my life. At least you're not apologizing to those people, though. Oh dear God, no! I apologize only to the people I view deserve it to a certain extent. I apologize to people I respect, or at least have some kind of goodwill towards. People who I don't like or anything like that to. Uh... Carving out an apology is kind of it's kind of a chore. Mm. Let's see. Still though, it's annoying me too, even. Ooh, Prime Knight says, found a great comment. Tarzan will always be white. Disney can't put a black man or woman type like a monkey in a movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so good. Oh. Yes. I mean, considering Wait, how... I'd totally make Jane black, though. I mean, come on. We all know that they are tone deaf enough to do that. Oh, God, could you imagine how quickly they'd get cancelled by the mob, though? Now I want to see it glorious. even more. And it's like, did Tarzan, I, I, I doubt they'll ever have the balls to make Tarzan, because whatever they do, it will always end in failure. <laughs> because if they do Tarzan white, it's going to be white savior. And if they do him black, it's going to be, well, whoopsie doo. <laughs> It's gonna be a beautiful fucking mess. That's what it's gonna be. Yeah, <laughs> glorious. They deserve to suffer. Oh yeah. Dear God, I want to see it now. That that would be beautiful. <laughs> Could you imagine? Oh God, I, I would actually use money to see that. I would actually spend money to see that. Well, Trim's got it excited now. Gee, and I've sort of sworn off all things. Uh, Disney. <laughs> but I would break that covenant to watch that shit storm unfurl. Yeah, you don't have to watch the actual movie, just the shit storm. Yeah. But I would spend money and just give them something like, thank you, Disney, for starting your own de demise. Quickening, hastening your own demise. Yeah. There we go. Uh, that's far from perfect, but it works. I see. It's not bad. Nah, could be better, but eh, it's works in progress. Yeah. Not doing that, but just slightly. I just want the textures there, you know, textures there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's try this one. And now for the light. The light. Let's see. F fading edge. So edgy. Oh, God. <laughs> We've all been teenagers. We've all been through yeah, hell. Some of us got. <laughs> oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Little son of a bitch, I'll have my vengeance for this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, I don't need to have vengeance here in Australia. Uh, I like how coming from Australia is, the, is your free pass to just be a grumpy old bastard. <laughs> it is. Uh, can't really, can't really take anything, uh, hold anything against you because, well, you're from Australia. <laughs> yep. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> oh. Man, I I like the old Tarzan movie. You know where he? Well, what? I don't remember the way. You know the one with the Phil Collins uh, songs. 
the actual Tarzan movie. Though, yes. The Disney one. Yes. I was a re I like the animated one. Also, series is pretty good too, but I prefer the movie. It was a really good goddamn movie. Yeah, but that was before Disney got white. Yeah. Oh, the, one of their best movies was around the same time, Pirate Planet. Now that's a fucking yeah. glorious piece of work. I watch it to this day. Yeah. I'm surprised that it actually bombed as it did. Because it's, it's just, just glorious. And everyone would be like, oh, Frozen is so good. And the adults like, oh, so we're just going to ignore this come of age story. Okay. Yeah, I've Bye. got none of that. <laughs> because your silly voice got cut off by this. Yeah, <laughs> of course. It's like, oh, so we're just going to ignore this coming of a perfectly fine common, coming of age story? In term of this fucking little princess with snow magic powers coming out of the closet? What? The fuck are you on a mountain? I'm talking about Frozen. I just like Frozen. Uh huh. Alright. I view it as one of the reasons for the downfall of the animated Disney. It really isn't. <laughs> it is one of the parts. But I fucked up a million other ways long before that. Oh, they did. Hiring Wokies, one of them. Yes. Man, remember the days when hearing some new Disney animated movie was coming out and you actually felt a little, it felt excitement for it? In what century was that? <sighs> I'm old enough to remember, but then again, I'm a very old and grumpy man. When I was young! <laughs> Bleach says, so 1996. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Basically. Now I got Phil Collins, the son of man, on my brain again. That's a good song. I think it says acceptable. Yes. Phil so, Collins is pretty fucking good. It is. He's a bit of a weirdo, but, you know, he's our weirdo. I have no idea why you're talking about Phil Collins being a weirdo. I know. Nah, I just watched the uh, the South Park episode with the guy. <laughs> oh, it's funny. You know, Trim, you actually have to tell us what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> Haven't you seen the South? About... Haven't you seen the South Park uh, episode where Phil Collins is one of the people? Uh, is one of the main characters in it? Timmy and no, Jimmy are. No, wait. no, not Jimmy. Uh, it Timmy was in a uh, in a band. Lords of the Underworld. Okay. Yeah. Shit, I can't explain this fucking shit. You need experience for yourself. It's one of the old it's episodes. Like Just not. You should. Because I've got standard TV. Why the fuck would anyone in I watch South Park? <laughs> because South Park is funny. No, it's childish. It is it's stupid. <laughs> exactly, and that's why it's funny. If you're a child, yes. Nah, not much of a child. You just have to be stupid enough to laugh. And I am stupid enough to laugh. Yes. Speaking of weird eyes, I don't see. Hey! Hello, we I was about to say weirdo. I blame Bezik. Hello, Ardent. <laughs> We've been bullying Ardent. Well, Disco and I were bullying Ardent the other day. <laughs> well, well, yes, I. So, nothing new? Well, no, no. Hmm. He needs some thumbnails, does the Ardent? Yes, he does. 
It's, it's all, all well and good to have, have his face, because we'll click on it anyway, but people who have never seen an artist before will be like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I'm not your buddy, guy. I'm not your friend, buddy. Totally butchered that one. Oh, I'm like now. Exterminate. Exterminate. Bleep, bleep, boop. Yeah, I have no idea what the fuck is wrong with the audio. Usually it's been pretty well, but now? Okay. Well, well, if I sound robotic to you, James, it's probably my internet. No, you, you sound well. Well, then it's... We need to fix your computer. <laughs> yeah. We'll have it to sort it out by next time. Let's see. How long are we streaming for now? Uh, a bit over two hours. Oh, shit. Nice. Oh. Thinking about uh, finishing the lighting of the fur here and uh, maybe calling it a day because uh, time is slowly passing and I got a few things I need to do. Yeah. Very nice. Is. I mean, we've got coloring, started shading shit, so. Eh. And we've finished a large, and we've soon finished the largest pieces of it, so. Maybe we'll manage to do only three episodes of this one, too, before we can decide what the next should be. <laughs> do feel free to post in the comment section what do you want me to see? Uh, what do you want me to see? Fuck words! To tell me what you want to see me draw next time! Hey, I did it! Fuck. Oh, dear. You know, I don't... English, what's that? I need a new brain. Just a new brain. Yeah. Preferably yes, with something that doesn't have right. dementia. <laughs> oh, dear. Good luck with that. Ugh. I cut my bloodline. <laughs> Arnold Party says, Samurai Pizza Cat. Okay. It's huh. a cat with a samurai cat with pizza. The Prime Knight suggests a dwarf warrior. Yeah. Oh. Hmm. Samurai dwarf <laughs> with a pizza. <laughs> Teenage mutant samurai dwarfs. <laughs> <laughs> Who let tr left trim unattended with the internet? <laughs> <laughs> you did! You did! Ah, uh, shit. This time you're the way. <laughs> oh, God, why did that crack me up? Apparently, I uh, didn't say it's apparently a shot. Seriously? Oh, my God. Is this some kind of Canadian shit or what? That must be. Or is on a new found uh, land thing. Mm -hmm. Remember, the only good thing to come out of Canada was Avatar. Uh. <laughs> but that's not enough to redeem them for what they've done. No, we'll never forgive them for Bieber. You know, I'm actually going to... I'm actually considering that... Uh, that the Canadian government might be full of Decepticons, considering how scared they are of trucks. <laughs> Bleach is like, that was good. The animated show, not the stupid fucking gay rape robot. <laughs> Birds or whatever it was. <laughs> oh, the animated show with the uh, different people shooting elements out of wherever. Or bending the elements, because bending is not magic, we swear. But I like the magic system there, it's a good one. Avatar was a really creative show, and it was just, you know, well made. <laughs> Bleach is like, I stand by that comment. Uh, ble well, Bleach doesn't have taste then. 
I mean, I kind of liked the movie myself, but it was because I really liked the effects. The story doesn't really do anything. And I like the robots. <laughs> So the living planet is a bit like, scary. Hmm? When you can count it up. Oh, well. When you can you found it, oh, I don't remember reckons the movie was better. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Pizza cats as old as I am, huh? Jesus. But have some Canada been on the mute list for years now? Yes, but I was just going to aim for the big population centers. <laughs> now all will burn. <laughs> yep. We'll just send a general warning to the people we like. Who knows taste. Notch, notch, <laughs> wink, wink. <laughs> yeah, I should never be uh, become a dictator or anything with power. Of course, I'd still be better than the average lefty, but still. Yeah. Any support for live action adaptations is haram. Mm. I think there should be more animated series and movies out there. Like like the ones with the spirit of the 90s, you know? Uh, but when you're almost there, stuff. Bleach. Bleach says Canada doesn't exist, it's just Newfoundland with extra steps. More there like East Alaska. <laughs> Oof. That's <laughs> cruel, but correct. Yes. Let's see. So... If I fuck around with that one, put it like this, and then I'll take this one. I take if you this fuck one. around, will you find out? Probably. I mean, just ask Antifa. <laughs> no, no, no. Uh, I wish they could do more finding out with their fights. One day. Maybe. Just maybe. They're not very smart, are they? No. Are they fascist anti-fascists? <laughs> I mean... Just look at them. I'd prefer not to, they're hideous. Uh, wow. Well. Let's see, if I do this, and I do this... Hey, what do you think about this, bestie boy? It's looking pretty good, man. Thank you. Well, then I guess if it's uh, alright by all of you, I think we're cutting it off here for now, and we'll aim for finishing the project by the next stream. Unfortunately, I don't know when that might be, but maybe Sunday, maybe Monday? We will never know. No. I'll yeet it out in the usual channels whenever we figure it out. <laughs> Bleach reckons it needs more jazz hands. Wait a minute. Just uh, me have a second here. Just... Hey. You're being cringe, Trim. Oh, yeah. <laughs> For God's sake. Oh, that's horrible. I'm gonna, I need to remove this. Ew. Bleach appreciates it, though. Yes, I did it for you. <laughs> oh, dear. Well, it's hideous. Yes, but it is my hideous thing. Yeah. That's what your mother says. Yeah, I know. Why do you think I mentioned it? No, it's like a crime. Have you given it a name yet? It's a chimera. Yeah, we can't no, call a chimera what? chimera. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm calling your cat cat. I'm calling this part for Bob. This is uh, Jeffrey. And this is uh, La Cucaracha Filipina Tocara Parva. <laughs> The, the the cockroach? 
Yes. <laughs> and the, the cockroach Filipino. Uh, we'll, we'll do it easy. We'll do it easy. This a Paul? Uh, Henning? Yeah, Paul Henning? Or Gustav? Have you tried the slightly less drug stream? I'm not on drugs slightly right now. Oh, so you're going cold turkey? I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> Uh, well, uh, I guess we are cutting it for this time. It's been fun so far. I hope you enjoyed the show. Thank you for joining Besic, and thank you for popping in. John Crow, you're welcome next time, if you wish. Uh, also, there will be a time lapse on this Sunday. Look out for that one at the usual day. And instead of, again, <laughs> since it won't be a Souls of Chatelet, I'll be doing a stream with uh, James, and I'll chill it in the usual channels. Hope to see you there. <laughs> you guys want to make a Bye. chill or a thingy? Ah, that's good. Ugh. Well, you've been able to chill yourself for a while anyway, so... Have a nice day, everybody. Goodbye. Bye. Cheerio. Everybody.